Valentine's Day is around the corner and I'm sure you guys have started searching for special recipes online for your loved ones. Every year I've been posting desserts or chocolate recipes for this day, but this year I've decided to go Italian with a very simple mushroom risotto. And of course, who wants to spend the entire Valentine's Day in the kitchen? So let's get started. I'm going to start with heating some olive oil. Also a little bit of butter. Once the butter is nicely melted, I'm going to add some onions. Saute the onions. Next goes in the garlic. And some finely chopped celery. the onions turn brown and now I'm going to add the arborio rice which is commonly used for risotto into the pan. It's extremely starchy. Next I'm going to pour in some vegetable stock. Make sure it's boiling hot and add a cup at a time. You can even add a cup of white wine before adding the stock to give it a nice flavour. Once you can see the stock is drying up, just add some more. You have to keep doing this till the rice cooks. I'm going to be using two varieties of mushrooms for this recipe. First is a button one which I've thickly sliced. And the second one is a shiitake mushroom which is a dry kind and I have just soaked it in warm water for 20 minutes and cover it. So this is how it looks after soaking and they'll become nice and soft. The rice needs some more stock. Let it simmer. Make sure you add the stock periodically and not at once and keep doing this till the rice cooks. I'm going to be using two kinds of cheese for this recipe. The first one is a soft cheddar which is going to melt very easily and give you a nice creamy texture. It's optional, if you don't have it you can use two tablespoons of cream. And the second one of course is the parmesan. So let's add it in. The rice is nicely cooked now and the stock is dried out. Since I have soaked the mushrooms in water, I'm also going to add a little bit of that water into the rice to give a nice mushroom flavour. Just some of it. There goes in the cheese. This one's going to melt so easily. Parmesan. Add as much as you wish. Stir it in. Salt to taste. Pepper. Time for some fresh herbs. I have some finely chopped chives and parsley. You can use any ones that are available. Mix it in. The rice is nicely cooked and I'm going to leave it at this consistency. And now time to cook the mushrooms. Just cover it. They're nicely soaked and soft. Just remove the stem because they don't cook very easily. So just get it out. Roughly chop them up. Also going to chop up some chives. 
for garnishing. Now I'm going to start cooking the mushrooms. So heat some butter to saute the mushrooms. Of course you can simultaneously do it while the risotto is cooking. But since I have only one burner here, I'm going to do it right now. Mushrooms. The shiitake as well. And toss. Let them cook for 3 to 4 minutes. The mushrooms are nicely cooked and now time to add them into the risotto. Stir it in. And the mushroom risotto is ready. Time to plate. Some parmesan cheese. Fresh chives. You can use any mushrooms of your choice or even vegetables. And one last tip, do not cook the risotto way in advance before serving because it tends to dry out. I hope you make this for your Valentine's Day and enjoy your meal. Bye-bye.